We're going to take notes on the four types of slope we were introduced to by Slope Dude. Again, it's not the highest quality video, but it really is one of my favorite videos on YouTube because in a really short time, it communicates three, some very important points about slope. What do you know about positive slope? What direction does it go? So let's draw a line that shows what a positive slope would look like. When we graph these, they get arrows at both ends. What about a negative line? Zero slope goes straight across. It is horizontal. And then the last one that is a math curse word, we do not say that word out loud in here. You can whisper it. It goes vertical, straight up and down. What does it mean to be undefined? It means exactly what it says. Slope is related to the y-axis on a graph. And the y-axis on a graph goes straight up and down. And slope only exists when it turns one way or the other. And so when it is straight up and down, there is no slope. This isn't no slope, it's zero slope. Because it's tilted from this y-axis all the way down to being exactly straight across. It has zero slope because it's tilted down to a flat line. There is no slope here. That's what it means to be undefined. Now, you're going to color code those in four different colors. It does not need to match mine. When your color coding is done, you're going to use this space down below to do a little bit of math art. You're going to put your first name using only straight line segments. So we're not writing like we normally write. And then we're going to color each segment according to the type of slope it represents. I'll be honest, my first name tends to be all zero and undefined, so I'm going to use my school name. Do you see the M for Mrs? Mm -hmm. Positive slope, positive slope, negative slope, and negative slope. This is how I'm going to do the R. So I get a little bit more lines to work with. Writing your name with just straight lines as best you can. Yes, Kellen? An E? I think an E is going to be straight down and then straight out, so it's going to be zero and undefined. <clears throat> and then you're going to go back with your colors and you're going to color code the parts of this that are positive, negative, zero, and 